Oh, why are you? Absolutely done. Okay. Tips with Teep Session. This is Cadillac Games in chat. So what we're focusing on this gameplay and what Cadillac wants to focus on is late game scenarios. He's a good player, but wants to get more wins overall. He wants to focus on his communication a little bit more and uh, overall just getting more Ws, whether it be Rebirth, Caldera, or whatever. Let's watch. Beams. Mouse and keyboard action. These boxes aren't loading for me. Damn. I'm blind. Yo, oh my goodness. What is going on here? This uh, is this a permanent flashbang? Like, what do you want? <laughs> right off the rip, very above average player. Right? Like, this guy know, knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. All right, so three off rip. They get Lodi. Easy clap. Okay, what happens here? Knife on Lodi. Buys the Lodi, gets caught. That's unlucky. That's rebirth for you. Unlucky. Skip forward a little bit. Looking like a Swiss and a well gun. W. Yo, what? Teammates get rolled. Did I just get sniped? Get the teammate first. Oh, fucking sniped me. Yeah, I just sniped me, bro. That's the Language! Yeah, he's talking a lot right now. Language! Like this. I don't either. Hostile dropping into the Enemy area. Close. Watch the skies. Oh, oh, oh Al, sniper behind. Enemy so, like, right here, you just kind of get put in a tough situation. Your teammates are just getting absolutely rolled. I'm going to keep it a buck. Going for reses most times in Rebirth are an absolute waste of time, right? If you're able to get a kill and a full kill or, or sorry a knock and a full kill on one guy all like honestly you just tell these guys to bleed most likely because like all you're gonna do is waste your fucking time going for reses and, and rather than when they can just drop back in on their loot a little bit later like unless you're like super late game and like the time like your guys are in a really good spot or whatever but like for how low ground you guys are you know they're gonna be top prison right you know there might be people at control you're not really sure yet your fight's happening here. Like, f honestly, in this scenario, and this is just a rebirth situation, fuck your teammates, respectfully, of course. But, like, you're just, like th it's just a time thing, right? It's just time. So, like, you're, what? One, two, three, like, three to four seconds away running, right? Honestly, you just tell your teammates to bleed, and you rotate down, and you get control control. Or you just say, later, gamers, and go into prison and try and get top roof. Wasting your own damn time. Did I just get sniped? Yeah, like this. I don't either. So you essentially lose like 20 seconds of your game trying to like... You know? And now you're still stuck in like this pretty bad position where you're not really sure where they're at. It's weird. Then you just get sniped from behind because you're just kind of in open field for a long time. Oh. All right. You get Lodi back, W, back into prison. Where you at, no. Movement looks good. You're dropping in. F Mitch Clantag, by the way. I knew I liked this guy. Cadillac, I knew I liked you, bro. F Mitch. What the? Telling my teammates from now, no res because Teep said so. LOL. Okay. It depends on the situation, okay? There are times where going for a res might be better than go than trying to just get the timer down for the quick respawns. Like, if you're top... It depends on what your power position is like. 
if you're hanging out, if you're banging out top prison, right? Or you're, you're in some sort of power position, like, you know, it, it, it all depends. Basically ask yourself, are we better in the position that we're in if we res, or is it better to reposition when you're in those scenarios? Usually in Rebirth, it's very easy to make those decisions because there's a couple positions on the map that are just godlike. Oh, he's a bullet. I see one. Unlucky. Aim was a little bit off there, but that's like a pretty... That's just a mouse gunfight. Controller, you probably hit every bullet. LOL. Aim assist, LOL. Oh, okay. All right, let's watch this play out again. So you lose this fight. Get knocked. Oh, he's a bullet. You get res. Give a plate box. So yeah, another screw your teammate situation here. You get rezzed, right? You you throw the plate box trying to be a good teammate. That's a W, right? As soon as you see these shots going down, you're out. You're off the scene. You are off the scene. You either want to go left alley and try and get second floor, or you go around the outside door here by the steps and. and you know, reset a little bit. Also, you have a stim, right? So one of those one of those options. You just gotta realize like that's not a fight you will ever win. Your your plan, like I, I totally understand what you're trying to do, is you wanted to play box, right? And then once you threw the play box, you're like, oh shit, what do I do now? And the play is later gamer. Full dip, full reset, stim, plate. You're chilling. You probably shit on this guy. Deadass. That's just unlucky. RPG. Fucking RPG from top prison. That's just unlucky. You get res. No one's gonna find me here. Your guys' positioning has been ass for for seventy percent of this gameplay. Bottom prison it is cool for a while, but you're here for way too long. That little that pathway outside of control building is fine for a little bit, but you want to get the hell out of there too. Like rebirth is a is so mixy. You don't, like you, you guys have been in the same sort of spots for like minutes at a time. That's like an eternity in Rebirth. Like, go away somewhere. That ass. And I'll keep it a buck Cadillac too. Like, you're you're a very much above average player. You should be just like you should be just getting getting after. I know this is just one gameplay, right? But like, you know, just one gameplay. I kind of want to just go. I kind of just want to go like get on top prison. There you go. Out. Yeah, you do. People under us in showers. Wanna ride with me? Let's go. Okay. Yo, uh, Master Asia, thanks for the 18. Nice win. W. Okay, all, all of his buddies are gone. All his buddies are gone. Let's move. Go. Oh, fucking heli. Oh, on me. Below. Another good win. W. Oh, I hope so. Oh, oh shit. Show me some. Show me some. Bop. Show me something. I like it. Saw another one. Bop. Little triple. W. Great oh, shout. So yeah, uh, yes, I agree. I agree. Nice place. Wow, shocker. You got top prison and you're way better than the lobby. So you're just going to fucking kill them all. Shocker. Do that all the time. Like, just go to top prison. Why Why fight anywhere else? Like, nine, you guys see me when I play Rebirth. I'm like 90% of the time top prison just killing everybody. If you want to farm a lobby, go there. Especially if you're sniping. Like, stop wasting your time. Dead ass. Uh, top water tower. Right below us. All right, we're getting uh, respawns disabled. You get zone pull. You're top prison. Let, let's see what happens here. No, I got stuck at the window. Fuck me, dude. 
your your teammates are just uh, respectfully your teammates are bots like where where are they right now who like there's no like rebirth is such a one dimensional map unfortunately but like where are your teammates like you just can't ah dude okay so, so we're getting to end game there's two teams left six left in the game let's see okay here's here's the decision making one zips up Ooh. Okay, so this guy just took the zip line and caught you. So you hear the zip? And that guy just kind of smokes you. He must have had a well gun or Owen as well. So, yeah, I mean, your chow wasn't great here when you heard the zip. But, like, overall, if you win this gunfight, you'd probably win the game. So... Based on this gameplay alone, you're you're a great player. What you said, you're a 1.7 to a 2.4. Literally, you could be like a 3 KD player. Right? So, the mantle wasn't great. I, I get you're trying to go for the chow. Maybe this hop up on the left might be a little bit better. But realistically, you just play the close wall and you just create like a line of sight here to chow this guy. Because there's no way this guy's good. So, like, I feel like with how you describe what you want to improve at, like, once you get to late game scenario, you said you want better comms, right? Hey, like, let's just keep it a buck. You're better than your teammates. You're going to be better than your teammates, whether they be Phil's or your whatever, your friends, most, like, 90% of the time with your stats. Hey, hey, guys, get top prison. Screw what you're doing. Go up top with me. Respectfully, you dumbasses. Just get top. Because if you're in, if you have even one or two more people up top with you there, you low key kind of bait them and just win the game because they're not going to get kills. You are. You t you direct them what to do. They don't know what the fuck's going on. They're bottom prison looking for a, a orange weapon because their loadouts are probably dog shit. So like, you want to do it. You don't want to be a dickhead though, right? And that's where a lot of people don't get it. You don't want to just like, you know, have an ego about it. However. You're top prison, and you're going to win the game. You you are. They're not going to win the game. You are going to win the game. You're, you're trying to play around your teammates a little bit too much, which I respect. But if you really want to win games, you, you know, they're the sheep. You're the shepherd. You know what I mean? Like, you need the sheep. But you, you're you the, you know, you, you got to direct the, you got to direct the action a little bit more. But uh, overall, you're, you're, yeah, you're solid at the game. I would say, like, based on some of your fights, too, your tracking is, like, a little bit... But, again, this is one gameplay, so I don't want to, like, judge your aim or sensitivity overall, right? But, like, your well gun shot, very, like, whoa! Like, tr really try and s smooth out your tracking, deadass. Alrighty? Nice game, Cadillac. But, that, like, if you, like, just calm it down a little bit, you hold top prison... Right? You have a gas mask. You don't have stims, which kind of sucks, but you also have a deadie too. You you got to use those things. And realistically, in this scenario, you should win this chow, right? You didn't. That sucks. Whatever. But you see where this zone is pulling, right? You want to probably rotate over here and get this top wall control and just laugh at the rest of the guys while they rotate out. So realistically, you try and win this gunfight. Boom. You jump up. You take high ground. You look down to the right. You look down to the left. Make sure no one's playing low wall right here. You jump. You parachute angled. You get top wall over here. You laugh at the rest of the lobby because you're a good sniper. Make it easy on yourself. You're a good player. You should be, like, literally with a little bit, like, more selfishness, which isn't, you know, I know a lot of people talk down on being selfish, but, like, you should be a 3KD player. You're, you're obviously good enough. GG. Let's open the next one. Thanks, Cadillac. Can we get a W in chat for Cadillac? Okay, we have Shredger coming up next. Uh, he plays zero to four hours of Warzone a week. He plays on PC. Um, uh, he wants to improve on rotations and get higher kill gameplays. Cool, fantastic. Uh, rotations, I seem to pick the worst rotations where when I review my own gameplay. Um, okay, straight to the point. I wonder what his stat line is. Usually having like a KD kind of helps me off the rip, but that's okay. Okay, here we go. Uh, looks like another rebirth. 
from Shredger. This guy's mic's gonna drive me insane. Plans over here. No kills yet. Okay, he's getting some kills. Another one. Easy double. Love to see it. Right over here. I'm coming with me. Downstairs. Should I go? Save your I'm taking fire here. I try to avoid the sh fucking line of fire. Hello. I missed the OTS ground loot. 1.35 KD. Okay. Okay. Somebody res me. I got the loading. Watch your back though. Alright, I'm with one. Right behind you, one. Oh, what was that? Nice shots. Right behind you, one. First thing I see, this is not a zero to four hours a week. He, like, is decent. Also, his movement is so, 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 so bad. He, he doesn't, like, he has auto attack sprint on, but he's not slide canceling or camering anything. Most of these gunfights, he's taking way less damage, right? Also, chat, you guys got to remember, uh, like, KD is not everything. I know some of you guys are going to have a lower KD and be better than someone with a higher KD. A higher KD could, could, could definitely mean that someone plays slower, right? That's just math. Up there, up there, up there. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a flank. What's the money like? They don't have money yet. So think, this he could die twice in this game, and what would his KD be? Like, let's say he dies twice and loses the game. He's on six. What's six divided by two? Like, you know, you know what I mean? One more. Also, one more thing. These are people that have submitted their gameplay for reviews. If you guys are going to be... I'm all for criticism, right? But make it respectful. And if you guys are a dickhead, I'm going to get you out of here, right? This is this is people putting themselves out there. And you got to respect that. And it's more than a lot of you guys would do, right? So, like, please. Let, there's, like, a certain vibe to be had here. Okay? Thanks. Fuck. He's right there. Oh, yeah. Get down. Get down like, if this guy, hit, hit, like, got more He's comfortable with the slide him. cancels and stuff. Don't raise him. I think I'm getting there. You know? Well, I need to try if, this, if this guy got a little bit more comfortable with the movement. Nice one. So he's on eight with no load, or he has a like loady gun, but. Oh, yeah, she's not like me. No. Oh, no. Look at him. Can you shoot him? Please. He's in the building. Yeah, he's in the building. In the building. <laughs> yeah, look, at, look at him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Please. Look at himself. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. Oh, my God. He got him. Yeah. Get these satchels, guys. Oh, yeah, she's not like me. No. Look at him. Can you shoot him? Please. He's in the building. Yeah, he's in the building. In the building. <laughs> and just look at him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Please. <laughs> what the? There's people in that building also. Head of us. Oh, right here. He just got out. He just got out. Enemy dropping into the AR. He's a boost one. I broke his shield. One inside. Can you take off that ping? Dang, he's raging at his teammates, bro. I don't think this guy plays with a scuff. Watch this jump shot. Oh, right here. He just got out. He just got out. Enemy dropping into the AR. I broke his shield. 
I don't, I don't think he plays with his scuff. Take off that thing. At least it doesn't seem like it. Damn, nice shot. Okay. Hello. Yeah, somebody above us. Somebody above us. Like, like not a single slide. Hit, like, his awareness, his comms, his shot, like all pretty good. He has zero movement though. He's on a default controller. Requesting yeah, they overflight. What's his loadout? Car 98. Car 98 OTS. Okay. By yourself, by you, W. Here, get selves and whatever. Whatever you need. People here. Oh, oh bang me, bang me. Oh, ghosted. Was he ghosted? Not ghosted. 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 Oh, bang me, bang me. Oh, ghosted. Bro, like, there, like this is just an overall tip for all you guys. You, the, I, I just know, quote, I mean this respectfully, but casual players don't look at their minimap. Like, if I'm not in a gunfight, I'm always looking at the minimap. Like, always. If you're not actively shooting at somebody, you gotta just, like, get it. Like, stop looking at your the middle of your screen and look at the map because you know exactly what to do based on that. Like, like literally, bang, bang, look at that. Up, up. You know, like, like, I know that's where most of you guys are messing up. Like, when you're not in a fight, dude. Especially in Rebirth, you get the pings, like, it's nuts. So when he's typing right here, like he is not strafing into his shots at all. Like look how rigid he is. Watch these shots. He, like, like instead of instead of him using right stick there he should be using left stick and just slightly strafing into his shot that way you don't have to like even aim at that point and then when the guy's running left you get you guys see how he's just like static like you got to keep you know recovered regained a little bit Fuck, I am so garbage. I bought a precision. Precision dead. Orange. On nice shot. Precision oh, yeah. orange. Grab that cash. Where, where, where? Hold on. Hold on. Good positioning for late game. Like, this is this should be so free. Are you on the roof, Edgar? No. Oh, shit. Nice shots. I down one right here on my side, on my side. Did I see him from across? Damn. Broken, 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 broken. Nice. Hit him again, hit him again. Good fun. One nice. more. Fuck. Oh. We downed each other. Is he close? <laughs> Lucky roast his voice. <laughs> I really enjoy the editing on this. <laughs> Wait, where one? Uh, okay. 30 seconds on rotation. They should be like they knew like the other team is over here. So in this situation, his teammate dies. There's no respawn. They're underneath. The other team's over here somewhere. They should be already having high ground. Like get the roof because it makes this far rotation way easier. The best rotations for this scenario. Does he, he has no gas mask and he has no stims. So you have to go earlier rather than later. Right? Gas mask and stims let you do whatever the fuck you want. And they're they're kind of crazy when it comes to like rotations. This guy says he needs to focus on earlier rotations. And he's not even thinking about it until it's like already too late. Basically back to the gas already. You have three seconds to try and get high ground or rotate low. But rotating low lowers your probability of winning by like a million percent. 
They they should already be up high ground, either on roof or on top floor, and then deciding which of these they're going to rotate to. These are probably the best. I don't think he'll make it all the way over there, though. So realistically, these like crates on the hill are are like the win scenario, right? Zone's going to start pulling this way. Maybe you can stay in zone here, depending on how far it pulls, like oh, down here to the right. But like, it's already too late. Like this fight down here is what he's focusing on. And it's just irrelevant. If that's what your focus is, right? He said he wants to focus on like late game and rotations and stuff. If that's the goal, you're he's five to ten seconds too late before it even, you know. Watch the stairs, assassin. Never mind. Now I'm watching. Got that. Got that. You got me. You got me. Watch out. Yeah, no, no. Now you're forced to make bad decisions. <laughs> Right? On the gas too. Shit. Just not good at all. Oh, they're inside. Yeah, yeah. Gas killed me. Like, like he survived. saw the last guy, so they're gonna win. But oh, we won. Let's go. Okay, just app like nice job. W, hooray. Just horrible. This lobby is not good whatsoever. Let's just be honest about it, right? It's not the highest skilled lobby. Like, this is just a goddamn mess. He, if if you focus on the early rotate there, he has to win zero gunfights, and I bet half of those guys die to the gas for free. Or just shoot each other, and the game's over. He got the kills, right? He barely got out alive. He didn't use his stuns when there's two guys in front of him as well at the tunnel. Like, you know? Like, he could have won that game probably without shooting a bullet. Okay, Here, here's my final take on, on this. Minimap awareness, not, he, he's not looking at his mi minimap, and that's problem number one. Like, that's throughout the entirety of the game. Constantly looking, constantly looking, constantly looking. Like, he's like a, a legitimate, a second or two behind on noticing where people are because he's not looking at his minimap. Second, he's using a default controller, and his movement is not nearly where it needs to be if he's going to take, like, the next step as a player. I'd recommend if you're going to stay on a default controller, you switch to like tactical, right? You slide with the right stick and therefore you can at least get the slide cancels going a little bit better. That's my advice because I used to, you know, you, I used to obviously use a default controller, but if he bought a teep scuff using code TP at checkout for 5% off, it would absolutely change his game. Let's go. Hashtag ad. Third, this kind of goes into the minimap thing too, but the zone pulls in late game is where I'm seeing most of these like most of the players that submit gameplay, they they don't immediately react to the information of where the zone's pulling in the late game. You're just behind, like you're behind. You, like they're consistently like wasting three to five seconds doing absolutely nothing with the information that's free. Last, his sensitivity is extremely slow with the sniper. And he's like, you you, you either need to up your, your sniper ADS multiplier so you can like not look so freaking clunky when you're trying to snipe, right? Because his sensitivity was so slow with the sniper. Wow. And he's not strafing into his shots, what makes it even worse. Those are like the, the biggest things for this review. So I think more minimap, sniper ADS multiplier potentially, and a controller with, with uh, paddles. And this guy goes from a 1.35 to a 2 point something, like almost immediately. Gigi, can we get a W in chat for Shredger?